Hello and welcome to another Baggy Brothers video and we're very fortunate today to be joined by Mark Antoine Fortune. Hello Mark, how are you? I'm, I'm good, you? Yeah, we're doing really well, thank you. Uh, I'm sure all West Brom fans know who you are, but just to give you a brief, brief summary of your time with us, obviously you spent half a season with us on loan back in 08, 09, uh, and then you joined us permanently from Celtic in 2010. And then so you were with us for about three and a half years in total. Um, and you obviously, you won Albion's, uh, uh, what was it, uh, Supporters Player of the Year for the half a season that you were with us. Yeah. And, uh, you know, obviously a great forward for us and scored scored many goals and did, you know, did some great things for us. Um, how was your time at the Hawthorns? Did you, did you enjoy playing for West Brom? What was, you know, what were some of the highs you had there? Of course, I had a re really good time there. You know, it was my first uh, club in UK when I came from the loan. So I really enjoyed the atmosphere and uh, the, the, the relationship with the, the fans, you know, in that stadium. Uh, when I arrived before the game, we used to park on the other side of the stadium and walk through the fans. So that's, that's quite uh, strong for a, for a club to, to do that because mm -hmm. I think now, no, no one do it, does it anymore. So yeah. everything is closed, and the fan, there's like a distance between footballers and fans. So I think it's helped me to 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 get into that uh, uh, league and to, to 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 always do my best for for the club. Yeah, you certainly did that. And um, what was your favorite memory whilst you're at the Hawthorns? Oh, <laughs> that's a tough one. <laughs> Uh, there's there's a, a lot of uh, great memories. Um, I, I would say my, my first game because he's against Middlesbrough. Yeah. I think uh, I came only the, the day before I trained once with the team and uh, I was fortunate to, to score and to and yeah. what a win. So it was uh, uh, the, the first trip, trip on since a long time. So I was really happy for the club and, and for me, obviously. Yeah. Do you have a, is, was, was that your favourite goal that you scored for the club or do you have another one that was kind of, that stands out as the best goal you've scored? Oh, the best goal. <laughs> uh, I have to get back to my memories now. So <laughs> <laughs> It was a while uh, ago, to be fair. Yeah, yeah. No, um, I would say every, every goal was, was the best one for me because now when I look back, uh, I can be proud of my career and my my time in West Brom. And I, I mean, I wasn't a striker that scored a lot, but I think I always try to bring something to the team. Mm. So goals, goals has never been the most important for me. I, I, maybe I would be ashamed to say that for a striker, but I think the most important for me was to my team was winning the game and and yeah, sure. we go forward, you know. Yeah, no, that's yeah. Um, who is your toughest opponent you ever came up against, if, for West Brom or another team? Who's who's the worst player to play against? Uh, the toughest one, uh, I think, was uh, Vidic. <laughs> yeah, oh. yeah, yeah, I wish that had a, a hard one with him, so I would say him. Yeah. It's a good choice. I mean, yeah, what a solid defender the, he was. Yeah, I think with, with, with the real tragedy on there, they were like a, a strong pair, a solid pair for Manu. And, yeah. you know, uh, I played them in, in the league and then uh, uh, I played them with the, we got the community, community shield. And so, so it was, it was a, a, they were tough defender. Yeah, yeah. I bet. Absolute rocks at the back. We've asked yeah, obviously yeah. a bit of a, a bit of a challenge of you as well today to come up with the the best eleven of players that you played with while you were at the Hawthorns. Uh, was that a tricky tricky list to make up of players? Yeah, yeah. Because again, I'm I'm a, like a, a team player, and you know I had a lot of uh, teammates during my time in West Brom, so the team changed all the time, and I've really. A great understanding with everyone. You know, mm. I know it's, it sounds maybe uh, impossible in football, but I'm the, this kind of guy that always adapting myself and try to make the other person uh, be comfortable with me. So sure, everything was fine. Uh, uh, it's a tricky one. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Who did, you, uh, who did you go for in goal then? Who is your goalkeeper? Uh, well, let's say. Let's say um, 
Yeah, Ben, Ben Foster. Good choice. As yeah, his choice. game, he's done really well. Uh, when I arrived, uh, I had the Scott, Carson, and so, and, and Dean Kelly. Yeah. So yeah. they were all uh, uh, good keepers, good goalkeepers. Uh, I, I say I would go for Ben, Ben Foster. Yeah, good shout. What's the formation you've gone for if you have got a formation? Uh, if I was a manager, uh, <laughs> I would go for four with like a sitting midfield. Uh, yeah. Four, let's say four, a uh, four three three. Four three three. Four three three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That seems fair. Who's at right back then? Right back. Um, I will go for Gonzalo. Oh, uh, Gonzalo Yara. Yeah, yeah. I will go for him. Um, I think he was uh, not the, 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 the best time. Maybe he did not show how it could be uh, the best for West Brom. But after we'll see with the, the Chile, Chile team, national mm -hmm. team that we was. He won the Copa America, so he's a great defender. Uh, on left back, um, I will go for Nicky Shore. Nicky Shore, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah Nicky is really, I think he's the smarter player that I saw, <laughs> I met. So yeah. on the pitch, he, he, he wasn't the strongest or the, the fastest, but he's always had the the, the 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 right place at the right time and and give the right ball at the right moment so i knew that with the the sight we could understand each other and i could just make the run and he would put the ball yeah yeah so nikki shore um so central defender i will go for jonas of course of <laughs> course <laughs> yeah <laughs> the king <laughs> the king and yeah. um with the well uh, that's a tough one. Uh, I hesitate between Abdullah and and Gabi Tamas. Yeah, yeah, Gabi Tamas. Yeah. Because we were on and off the pitch, uh, good friends. So uh, I, I would go for Abdullah Maite. <laughs> Abdullah Maite, nice one, yeah. We, we yeah, appreciate yeah. It. this is obviously uh, quite tricky to come up with these lists. Yeah, I know. Especially yeah. if you've yeah. you know you've had a decent sized squad around you, and obviously, like you say, you're close friends with a lot of them. You're kind of like, uh, do I want to pick that guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I will receive after some message. <laughs> yeah. yeah, as soon as the video goes live, you'll just get a you just get a DM just going, um, where's my you name? Good enough. Where's yeah. my name on the list? And you'll be like, oh, yeah, sorry. God, what about midfield? Uh, Who's going in that centre? Uh, Yusuf. Yusuf. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. So I think he showed that he was a a big pillar of the, the team when he was there. And he has to be in that team for me. Yeah. So um, with uh, Moza also, Moza and uh, uh, Chris uh, uh, Chris Grant, Christopher. So for me, they they have like they are like uh, proper baggy players. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They, they, they've been a long time there. They, they, before I arrived, they were already there. And after I left, they, 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 was, they were still there. So yeah. for me, they have to be in that team. Um, and then uh, there's three, three places left. Huh? Yeah, <laughs> three, three forwards, yeah. So uh, yeah, I will go for, for Romelu because... Uh, Sure. He's also a friend and I think when he arrived, he was um, like a young player, but that wanted to, to progress and, and to listen. And I tried to, to, to get him under my wings and, and, and uh, give them a chair within my experience. Mm. So... Well, whatever your shared works, look at him now. He's one of the world's yeah, best. Yeah. Days, so. <laughs> you heard it here first. He learned it all from Mark. The only yeah, reason he's yeah. top of his game, he learned it all from you. 
I gave him the recipe, so <laughs> <laughs> the secret one, the secret recipe. So no, I'm happy for him. Today is one of the best striker in the world. So mm. that's a big achievement for him. And uh, I think he, he did not finish yet. He will he will do more 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 things. So I will go for Romelu because when he came, he scored a lot, and then uh, he, also he. he he, he stay in history with the last game of uh, yeah. Sir Wilson. So Romelu, um, yes, Peter, Peter with him. Oh, the yeah. winger, yeah. yeah. Peter the wingy on the right or left. So sorry, Peter, not on the, <laughs> on the striker position, but uh, Peter also is a big striker for West Brom, mm. and. Um, I will uh, finish with. Um, I mean, you can put yourself in the team if you want. Yeah. No. Uh, uh, <laughs> it's tempted. It's a temptation, but no. <laughs> <laughs> Just a uh, minute, one more time. Yeah, because uh, when I was there, um, yeah, it was me, Peter, Romelu, or uh, before that. Uh, uh, was Simon okay. Cox, was Simon Cox around when you were there? Uh, just the first uh, first six months, then you went for loan. Yeah. Um, okay, uh, I will uh, I will put myself <laughs> yourself. Do it, do it. You might as well. I, I've been a team player for, for a long time. I, I'm being selfish now, so I put myself. Yeah. <laughs> That's well deserved. It's your best eleven. Yeah, you might you feel you can't you can't not be in your own best eleven. <laughs> yeah, it gives you a chance to play with all your all the lads one more time. Mm. In a make so, yeah, football match. I will play with them. Yeah, yeah, of course. Nice. If you look that way, it's a, it's, you're right. Yeah, that's a great squad. That's it's a, a great team. It's a great eleven, isn't it? So, mm. yeah. That we play for the eighth play between the sixth and eighth in Premier League, I think, easily. Yeah. How would you, how would, how do you reckon this team would fare in the Premier League right now? Right now, as I say, in the the first eight place. Solid. Oh, so yeah. we're getting. So this team would get in Europe, pretty much. I like that. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. It's, but yeah, especially I guess if you take Lukaku now as well. Yeah. Just yeah. goal scoring machine. Yeah. What, sure. What a three up front that is. That's just yeah. 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 yeah nice. You have to, to to take also the the, the former Marc Antoine, the former Peter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All prime prime yeah, players. Yeah. At your prime. <laughs> Excellent. Brilliant. We really appreciate you taking some time today to speak to us, Mark. Thank you so much for coming down and giving us your 11. Um, if you've enjoyed that video, obviously, please click subscribe and the like button because that helps us out. We'll put all our socials on the screen as well so you know where to find Mark and you know where to find us as well. And I guess we will see you in our next video. Thank you very much. With pleasure. Thank you.